forgot to mention it earlier. Um, going back to Godzilla. Right. Uh, so apparently that movie takes place in the same universe as King Kong, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. So they're trying to build their own cinematic universe. So it He's seems like, like uh, a lot. I mean, what is your opinion on so many of these studios trying to create their own shared universe and basically trying uh-huh. to be the next MCU? Marvel did it really pretty well with the Avengers. Superman Cinematic Universe brings a lot of money, so everyone wants to do the same. I mean, last generation it was Harry Potter. You know, everyone wanted to adapt their own young adult novel. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, I remember the, that. The yeah. Hunger Games, the early 2010 young adult novel that everyone wanted yep, to have their own. Yep. Hunger versions. Games. Yeah. It's just, what, it's just what was that? chasing trends. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, what's your opinion on that? Let's let's talk about it. I mean, it is what it is. It's a little silly, but hey, man, if it creates a great product, then who really cares? I'll watch it. Like. That's what, that's what happened to Marvel, you know. Not very many people thought Marvel could really pull something like that off, but it took them over a decade, but they did it. For me, I think that's the big thing for me is, like, um, creating a, a great product, right? So yeah. if they're more focused on just copying everything that Marvel did, then I, mm-hmm. I don't think they can create a great product because they're just chasing... I'm trying to word this right. They're just they're chasing, chasing a trend. They're chasing a formula that they think works and in a way it does but um i don't know it's it's like you can plan and set up and do all you want but if you can't make a good movie if you can't make that first good movie then Mm -hmm. you know you're not going to get people on board right so he's rushing it that's all it really is it's just people rushing through all these trends trying to cash in the cow while it's still hot (laughs) don't realize that you know marvel took 10 years to set all this up but yeah everyone's trying to do it in three they uh did you see that thing that was like um, a Tom Cruise movie, The Mummy? I think they were trying to yeah, build like Crazy a uh, dark, universe. dark universe with that one. Yeah, that kind of sucked. <laughs> <sighs> of course, it's not gonna work. I don't I heard, know. Uh, it came out with the Invisible Man next, which is the right move because instead of trying to make a big grand action mm-hmm. movie, which it really wasn't, these were small Universal monster movies. You know, I they heard could, that they was good. To a smaller studio, yeah. So they gave it to Blumhouse, a studio known for doing smaller horror movies. Because that, yeah, Invisible Man turned out to be a good movie. Is that part of a cinematic universe, or you know, like <laughs> probably <laughs> at this point? I mean, at this point, they're doing the smart thing, which is just make the movies. If it's good, sure, throw them together in a the universe. Mm-hmm. But that's mm-hmm. what Marvel did. They're yeah, like, let's make Iron Man. Let's yeah, let's make Thor. Mm-hmm. And eventually, they're like, yeah, it's, it's working pretty well. Let's make the Avengers. 